Google Docs, how to drag and drop notes from Google Keep into Google Docs. Google Docs is one of the simplest and easiest ways to store and quickly access documents between Google accounts while Google Keep is a useful tool for making and storing notes. But how do you drag and drop notes from Google Keep into Google Docs? Google, one of the world's biggest and most successful tech companies, just keeps making life easier for us. Google Docs has become a vital option for document creation, sharing, and editing across the world. And Google just made it better. Google Keep, another Google software tool is now part of the Google suite of tools available to users. This tool is a simple way to keep hold of notes and additional resources to add to a document you are working on. But how do you use it? Enabling your features To begin, you need to actually enable the connection between Keep and Docs. First, you open up your Google Docs tab and go to Tools. In that drop-down menu, there will be a Keep Notepad selection. If this is your first venture into Google Keep, it will prompt you to enable the feature. Select the Try IT option and the new feature will open in your document. And now you are ready. How to drag and drop notes from Google Keep into Google Docs Dragging and dropping can be done when Docs is open. Again, click Tools and then Keep Notepad, opening up the Keep sidebar. From here, you have two options to drag and drop notes from Keep into Docs. The first is the easiest. Simply click and hold your cursor anywhere in the note box and drag it over into the document. A blue marker will appear to let you know where the note is about to be dropped within the document. Drop the note by letting go of the mouse click. The title of your note will also be added to the text, so delete where needed. The second option makes you hover your cursor over the note. A drop-down menu will appear above the note, giving you the option to add to document. This will drop the note wherever the text cursor currently was, so make sure it is in the right place before this process. To get rid of the Keep sidebar, simply click the little X icon at the top right corner of the sidebar.